So I'm from California and I run one of the largest primitive survival schools in the United States. We teach about three to 4,000 people primitive skills a year. They were, oh, there may be smoke, but there's not fire yet. Having the chance to come to Africa, the cradle of civilization, it's super special. I think my wife would say that this is what defines me. Um, the, the long walk is kind of in my blood. One of the toughest aspects of coming out here is leaving my kids, trying to explain to them, having them ask me over and over again, why are you going away? You know, that's really tough. If we're gonna make it through this, uh, we're gonna need to support each other in not only the physical task, but mentally and emotionally. Thank you, of course. You know, it's a monumental task. We're asking a modern group of people to come to a place where they have no experience, no background, and do something that people that have been here for, you know, thousands of years would have trouble doing. But we're gonna have to learn by trial and error. It's, it's gonna be learning the hard way. I have no experience with lions, with, with rhino, with hippopotamus, alligators. Um, as far as you know, living among them you know, on a daily basis, uh, that's, that's not my experience. Uh, it's none of our experience. We're in above our heads in a lot of ways. It's going to take real vigilance and, and real caution on our part to be able to make this through safely.